I'm Carly Shearer and I work in the Modern and Contemporary Art Department here at Lyme and Turnbull. Our first auction of 2021 is Modern Scotland, a private collection of Scottish art. And in this video, I'm going to introduce you to one of the top lots from this sale. Ken Curry's A Tree of Liberty from 1988. So obviously from the more contemporary end of the collection. For Curry, there is always a political element to his work. Uh, he has a vision of a more fair and just future and especially in this period of his painting he liked to use his painting to, to communicate that so they're always a kind of like almost a utopia view of a, of a better world. And the, a tree of liberty does have that so in the centre of the canvas we've got the tree rising up with the books and the jewels of this new way guided by education and people labouring to bring that forth, to allow that to grow and develop, but around there are elements of chaos and, and old things being swept away and there's some burning buildings and people are rising up in protest and so it's a communication of, of how this new order, he sees this new order coming, that there will be some destruction to make way for the, the new and the better future. So it's a real strong statement in canvas of, of what he believes and it also comes from a really significant moment in Curry's career. So in the late 80s the new Glasgow boys were very much at the forefront of Scottish art um, and there was a lot of worldwide attention um, on this new figurative um, approach coming out of Glasgow um, and he was a key player in that. Um, and he also painted this in 1988, so the summer of 1988 he paints this and that is the year following um, his involvement in the landmark A Vigorous Imagination exhibition. So he had had um, kind of a lot of exposure at that point, um, a bit of celebration of his work and he was coming out of that when he painted this amazing painting. So I would highly recommend, well obviously I've seen some of it in this video, but I would highly recommend having a look on the website um, to see it. And we have um, also shot it in our sale room to try and give you a sense of the scale of this amazing piece. I hope this has been of interest. If you have any further questions on this amazing painting, then please don't hesitate to get in touch. We are always delighted to talk works through with anyone in advance of the auction. And as I said, the auction is taking place on Wednesday the 20th of January, kicking off at 6pm. And I very much hope you will join us live online for that. Thank you very much.